what's up YouTube so I've made some videos at this location before we got a daikin you can see I took the door off we got this track here I'm gonna change that a reducer assembly you know listen and we're gonna pull and clean this wheel so I'm gonna show you See when that door would be on this, the track is coming out, and listen, you're gonna hear the gears. There's a reducer assembly in there. It's gonna come all the way out. Then it comes, you hear the gears. It, the weight of the door makes those gears strip out, and then it, it shuts down. So, you can see it never even tried to open up. So, it's gonna. It's going to close back off, and you're going to hear the, maybe you will. Oh, it didn't do it that time. Uh, you hear it, those are the gears slipping. If you look inside here, man. What the hell, look at that. I don't know how well you can see it. Everything is pretty dirty, so. All right, we'll go from there. All right, guys, so. You got a screw here, you got a screw up there. This whole thing will lift up. You can see up and out of your way. You see how nasty it is. And you get the wheel out. You got a little, I don't know how well you can see it, a little Phillips screw right there. And everything will slide out. I'm going to drop all this down and we can get in here. See, it just, it all just pops out. You disconnect it. And we get everything cleaned up. And uh, this is, you'll see it, this thing right here is our thing that's slipping, or reduce a gear assembly or something like that, you see it? So, it's just one screw for it. So, right in there, a Phillips screw. So, give me a minute. All right. I mean, I don't know if you can really, guys can really tell how much dirt came. <laughs> All right, so I'm looking at this, I'm looking at the drain, I don't know how well you guys can see it, but down there you see the screen. This thing is all full of slime. There's another one. I just put out a video of the mini orange pump with the screen in there. It gets all full of slime. And it doesn't allow it to drain properly either. So we're going to get everything cleaned up. All right, YouTube. So uh, we're all back together. We're going to turn it back on. And um, once we'll make sure everything's working, then I'm going to show you that reduce the gear assembly. What I'm talking about, if you guys... Because uh, this is the place I normally clean these wheels in place. Because... We've had it where we've pulled the whole freaking casing off, and now the damn thing won't work. So since I had to replace that assembly, I just pulled the wheel. So we're opening. I'm just going to throw my probes on it real quick. I don't know if you can hear. I'm sure you could hear the air. That feels good. <laughs> nice airflow. So we are working. Here is that gear assembly. Reduce the gear. Inside here, these things uh, start to strip out with the weight. And what, so it starts to open. I think it's like halfway or so. One of the guys I work with, he, he marked all this and watched it one day. And you can see it comes open halfway. It hits that. And then I'll start to close. That's how it's an air proving switch, pretty much. And this just plugs in all right on right underneath it. So if you do it, you got to get to this little clip right there. You fight it sometimes. And if you ever want, right there is the port number. So, all right, guys. I just figured I'd take you along for the ride. Out here in the Tampa Bay area, man, we're waiting for Hurricane Ian. It's supposed to be hitting us here, so we're just trying to get as much stuff done as we can. All right, guys. Man, if you liked it, man, hit that 
like button, make a comment, do something. I guess. See you.